follow as day one as part of this interfamily systems process that we are going to follow together for the next 90 days is today's day one exercise is for you to simply sit down and consider for yourself what is it that you would like to personally achieve with your parts and with the interfamily systems process um, in the next 90 days. So kind of spending some time and I don't know if that would be through a process of journaling or meditation or closing your eyes or doing some deep breathing or taking a few moments of just quietness, just ponder this, is what is going to be your goals? What would you seem or deem to be success for yourself in 90 days time? So projecting yourself outwards and asking yourself, where are you today? And how do you want to navigate? What kinds of achievements do you want to as, as, um, assess in the next 90 days? And so one of the things I think is really important is that parts work is an iterative and an emergent process. So one of the things that you can really start to consider right now is to do a couple of things. One is to temporarily suspend any disbelief that you may have in this process. You may think this stuff is airy-fairy. You may think it doesn't apply to you. You may initially, because you may be very blended with your parts, may not have any association with anything I talk about in the next little while. But I will tell you that over time, through an iteration and a repetition, there will be an emergence of understanding. And so I'm just really asking at this stage as for your consideration as you project out for your goals for the next 90 days is to consider how you may want to, what you want to achieve and how you're going to go about achieving it. So the first one is really to temporarily suspend your dis disbelief. And the second piece to that is really doing the exercises and really employing them on a day-to-day -day basis. Even if it doesn't feel like it relates to you or it applies to you, just even if you take a minute in that day to reflect on it, it will be amazing to see when you create pause in how some things are eventually going to percolate and there'll be a new neural network and there'll be some lateral association and some heuristics evolve where sun, suddenly something may pop for you. You may, this is actually a process for us to engineer some serendipity or an aha moment for you or a eureka moment where you'll have this an explosion of self-discovery. So really kind of do those exercises, even if you feel like you can't relate to it. So I'll leave it at that, and then we will proceed to day two.